what's going on YouTube real to dog back with another video lack of content lately I know but there's a lack of a lot of things these days right now uh, hope y'all are staying safe and healthy and all that during this whole pandemic thing you know <laughs> today we are gonna be installing a uh, I think it's called a B pillar brace bar what I'm specifically putting on is a OEM Type R. Normal base and, and Type S, they, they have just like stamped steel like the rest of the chassis, but the Type R one had an aluminum one. It's thicker, more rigid and stiff, but still lighter at the same time. It's gonna be a worthy upgrade. I'm gonna gain some a little bit of uh, rigidity, but also a little bit of weight reduction. All right, so yeah, it's in this box right here. Uh, I got it from ICB Motorsports. If you don't know who they are or who that is i'll put uh, their <clears throat> website and his instagram in the description basically in short he does a lot of like like straight from japan uh jdm parts mostly for hondas shout out to him for hooking me up with the parts uh there's another part in this box that has that's going on the rsx but that's for another video but yeah let's take this bar out all right so here's the part it is a uh, pretty nice you can see from the factory they got the type R the special type R treatment with nicer welds uh, as you can see here this thing is so light uh, I can't really I don't really know the weight specs off the top of my head so I'll probably sanitate them here on the screen compared to the OEM steel one let's get in the car and see how this goes on so, right here, where the rear seats should be, right there is where the bar is, this is the OEM one. Uh, four, four bolts, one, two right here, two right here to the chassis. Uh, and then there's two on, on each side, one under here, see that? And then one in here. This would be a lot easier if you didn't have these side panels, obviously, but I'm stubborn and I'm gonna try and do it with it still on there. So yeah, let's uh, let's try and get this bar out of here. So here are the two bars side by side, more or less. OEM, Type R. Type R aluminum one has better, stronger welds looking. Let's look at in here. As you could kind of see, this is the OEM one. Look how thin that is. And here's the Type R one. Look how it's a lot thicker. Yet, this is easily several pounds lighter it's not that big of a mod it's simple but you gain more than you lose well the only thing you lose is weight a little bit and then you gain chassis stiffening so it's a win-win really um so yeah let's put this baby on
right guys so there it is it's done both of them down double triple checked for tightness by the way I don't know the uh, torque specs for these if there are some and uh, but honestly these bolts they'll they'll tighten down and then stop so that's usually when you need to know when to stop so I'm not gonna record it but from here on I just need to put this carpet back up pushing these panels in a little bit more in their spots and it's done here what it looks like from from the back along with those uh jay's racing fender braces that i installed a few videos back this is also a legit authentic jdm part that i will never get points for or anything because no one's ever gonna see it unless you watch this video obviously but hey function before form right that's track life right there not a terribly hard thing to install you don't get any cons with it really other than the price you have to pay to buy it you lose a little bit of weight, gain a little bit of stiffening. What's uh, so bad about that? Give uh, ICB Motorsports a follow. Check him out. Check out his, his inventory, what he's got installed, or what he's got in stock. He might have some stuff, stuff for y'all's cars. I don't know. Um, shout out to him for hooking me up. The other part I'm going to be installing is from him too, but that's for another video. Well, I'll get into that in another video. Yeah, that's it. If, uh, you know, please, uh, like this video if you liked it and share it too if you found it useful, you know, thanks for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't yet and see you all in the next video. Peace.